So I gotta say first that uh, this, is, this is not how I thought I'd ever start vlogging. Uh, but I do think after all the conversations I've had the last couple of weeks and this week and today and watching the weather that this is an important uh, safety announcement uh, is that a lot of the ice is unsafe. If you don't know, don't go. If you haven't cut holes checked how thick the ice is don't trust following other people's tracks now that goes for snowmobilers who are new and people who have been snowmobiling for years because there's tons of people that go through the ice every year um, the majority of deaths every year associated with snowmobiling are not trail riding related they're not on ofsc trails it's on lakes it's on fields etc it's generally not on ofsc trails so I wish the trails in the Perry Sound, North Bay area were open. I think it would be much safer. I know COVID, whatever, but I think it would be much safer for people to spend this family day weekend riding around groomed, marked trails instead of running around the lakes, uh, especially big bodies of water. So Perry Sound, Georgian Bay, I believe Southern Georgian Bay, and I'm sure Simcoe uh, are very unsafe in a lot of places. Uh, what happened is we had everybody knows we had a warm January ice didn't form the way it normally does. It's a bad year for Great Lakes ice and Georgian Bay ice. Uh, then we had a huge wind that came up. The wind blew all the ice in, which will be great for pack ice once it freezes. Uh, but then we got snow and the water level rose at the same time and all of that. So that's sort of some unfortunate weather and that's going to cause the top layers of the ice that is there to turn to slush. Uh, so you may be on snow, it might feel solid underneath, but it could just be a few inches of slush underneath you. You might go right through slush and right into the water. So please, everybody, do your best to stay off those big bodies of water. Maybe stay off the ice at all. Uh, certainly watch out for, you know, creeks coming into bodies of water. Even if you're on a small lake, uh, you know, some of them are frozen good, but some of the bodies of water where there's rivers coming in, water flow, etc. It's gonna you know, be slushy and warm there. Just be super careful, try and stay on shore. Don't stop on the ice if you are on it. I suggest don't stop in the middle or anywhere. Make sure you get on shore before you wanna stop. And I, you know, just be super, super careful and avoid it if you can. I'd appreciate it. So this is the first uh, vlog message from Random Ryan. And uh, please, you know, and Dr. C, I don't know how to pronounce your name from North Bay. I think you should consider opening the trails tomorrow, Friday, before the long weekend. I think you'll save a lot of lives and keep people safe by allowing people to be on the trails where it's groomed and safe and, uh, you know, even first responders can get to them easier than in the middle of a snowy lake or something. So I hope you consider that as well. All right. Random Ryan out. Thank you.